What's up guys, Monthly Black of Cheese review here today and uh, we're going to be trying some Cabot Horseradish Cheese today. Uh, I'm actually really excited about this because Horseradish Cheese is one of my favorite types of cheeses. I know I already said that for the Gouda, but this is actually probably one of my top two uh, It's in there. Uh, I remember the first time I actually had this was uh, I went to a cheese festival, really surprising there, right? You know, I went to a cheese festival, uh, my mom picked it up, shout out to you mom. And uh, I tried it, and I just fell in love. It's, it's a really good type of cheese. So uh, let's get right into it. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to say is that this is probably the worst horseradish cheese I've ever had in my entire life. There's so much horseradish taste that you can hardly tell where the cheese is when you're eating it. It's like biting into a solid brick of frozen horseradish. It's not, it's just not good. It doesn't taste okay. It doesn't taste like horseradish cheese should. It's, I know it's called horseradish cheese, so you'd think that you'd be able to taste some of the horseradish, but this is just too far. It's over the top. It honestly feels like they put cheese as a, like, they layered cheese on top of horseradish, and they tried to pass it off. <laughs> it actually hurt to finish chewing that. I thought about spitting it out the entire time. I don't, overall, I have to give this cheese, like, a 1 out of 10. I absolutely despise it. I hope I never have to eat this again, and I will not recommend Cabot horseradish cheese to my friends. That is Monthly Block of Cheese Review, signing off.